Hello and welcome back. Today I've got a small uh, unboxing and a minifigure review for you. But first let's uh, get on into it. If you do enjoy my comment, uh, content, please uh, consider subscribing, liking and commenting on my videos. Let me know what you think. But let's roll on into it. First off I'll do um, the unpackaging and show you what I got. I got, um, I'll just uh, tip it out just quickly. Oh, whoops. Uh, I've got a bunch of uh, brick arm uh, weapons uh, from United Bricks. Uh, he's on Instagram. He has a store. I'll leave all the um, links in the description below, but we'll get on into it. Uh, first off, I've got the Galactic Gunfighter overmolded pistol and rifle. Uh, I'll get them out of the packaging in a minute. Um, potentially uh but yeah i got this ready uh for when i get the new mandalorian um trouble on tantawine set so i could give uh my beskar armor uh, mandalorian um screen accurate weapons for it so i got those ready um I, I am waiting for the razor crest to come uh at the moment so hopefully i'll do an unboxing of that uh, thing but I'll just put that to the side and I've got two of uh, the blaster revolution uh, uh, blaster stellar weapon pack and on the back it is a description of all the weapons there again this one does come with another galactic gunfighter rifle I'll probably give that to the razor crest one with his old armor um, and I'm gonna try and get the Mandalorian ATST uh, eventually and give uh, the heavy blaster to Cardoon and all that and uh, here's the other one with more weapons and like uh, a mixture of all like the Star Wars eras so like you got some first order weapons here uh, such as um, uh, this one here and like the heavy one blaster uh, which is the FWMS-10 but like that'll be good to give to like the small first order troopers I've got um, got a bowcaster up there, but I'll put those back there. Also, I've got ordered another ten DC fifteen uh, S's, um, and I've got a couple of freebies in there. So like a, a olive green vector and a brown MG forty two in there. Uh, I could get those out for a minute, but like that's one thing. Uh, thing like a bit of a channel update. Um, potentially uh, getting uh, some uh, other military figures, so like World War One, World War Two, modern military. What do you guys think of that? And uh, let me know what you think. But let's go on into my uh, attraction. I I've had this figure for. Um, like about a month now but i just haven't put them on the channel yet because i've been doing more of the clone wars era stuff uh but i've got a custom cob vamp figure uh from uh get your kicks before order 66 uh, and he's uh, made this using custom uh, uh regular lego parts so what he's done is uh use a boba fat helmet Man or an armor, I think it's from a Christmas set. Uh, like Han Solo trousers, he's added a Karma, Boba Fett's helmet. I like what he's done with the weapon, added on this Technic piece here to give the effect of like the wrapping he has on it. I might just use, I think it's in this pack, um, the DH-17 uh, weapon, or like the, they yeah, like get a white rubber band and rub it, uh, wrap it around the barrel and i might do that um as an alternative and swap that out let me know what you think um but this is uh like this is the first one he ever put on his site of cov vamp he has uh updated it since then but i got the first one so this was more like the prototype so i'll just swap his headpiece over if i could get on Sorry. Is there something stuck in there? I 
for some reason it doesn't want to go on now. Uh, but it, it, it did go on previously. I think it's just where I sat. Just can't get on properly. There. Sorry. I, I, oh, no, I got... I was catching on the jetpack. That's why I couldn't get on. My bad. But, yeah, it's got a nice backpack on there. I don't know where the backpack's from, if it's from a previous Boba Fett set. But, like, the rocket does come out. But now it won't. There. So you could actually make a couple of play features with this, which I like. I don't know where the backpack's from, if it is from thing i'm just going to leave that off for a second but he has uh, updated it if you go look on his thing he's actually used a different face and actually hand painted on the newer model so this is the first thing so i think this is our old uh, lego face he's um it looks like a count dooku um hair piece but like in a different color so if you've got one of the old count dooku's uh so like that's that but I think this is actually really nice and really well done. Um, got a Boba Fett helmet, as you know. Got the range finder. But I think this has come out really, really well. Uh, I will probably get the updated one that he's done and just flick that off. But let me know what you think. Uh, again, I'll leave his description in the thing. And uh, I'll catch you all next time.